In May of 2018, something weird happened over the Arabian Peninsula. A large cyclone passed over the Rab Al Khali Desert. A massive stretch of unbroken sand, also called the Empty Quarter, it usually looks like this. But after the cyclone, it looked like this. Lakes had formed between the dunes. The desert was filled with water for the first time in 20 years. Then, five months later, it happened again. Another cyclone hit. Over the next year, powerful cyclones kept coming out of the Arabian Sea at a frequency not seen in decades. It caused catastrophic flooding in normally dry areas across the region, but especially here in East Africa. Today, the floodwaters have receded, but they left behind. a different type of disaster millions of locusts this is a desert locust it's a type of grasshopper that lives across this area from northwest africa to western asia typically desert locusts spend most of their time alone in what's called their solitary phase but if the weather starts to shift that can lead to a transformation if normally dry area becomes unusually lush with vegetation as it would after heavy rains these insects will start to congregate that sudden crowding triggers a hormone and the locust starts to change it starts with a color shift from a muddled brown color to a bright yellow its body shrinks and its endurance increases which optimizes it for flight its brain grows and so does it appetite this is called the gregarious phase they eat and breed leaving their eggs in the damp soil when they hatch they form what are called hopper bands swarms of tens of thousands of non-flying but voracious insects that move together as a unit Eventually they develop wings and once they start flight it's almost impossible to stop them locust swarm ride the wind which allows them to travel up to 150 km a day a single swarm can contain up to 150 million insects per square kilometer each one consumes its body weight in vegetation daily in 24 hours a swarm of that size eat more food than 35000 people since late 2019 east africa has been experiencing its worst locust outbreak in decades in 2020 the area has seen swarms as large as 2400 square kilometers that's a swarm of insects over three times the size of new york city capable of eating as much food as tens of millions of people The swarms of bugs are so thick that airplanes have been forced to divert their course. Billions of ravenous insects sweep through areas, decimating acres of farmland and threatening already food scarce regions with famine. And they are spreading. In February, Pakistan declared a state of emergency. By late May. The swarms had reached parts of northern India for the first time since 1962. And the biggest factor in all of this is the weather. Locusts reproduce exponentially when the weather is in their favor. With every new generation, the population increases 24. So, if normally dry area stays wet for a long time, the population will explode. And That's what researchers think happened starting with the 2018 cyclone the unusual amount of rain leads to an unusual amount of vegetation which lead to an unusual number of new locust swarms formed here in the unusual wet desert and made their way into surrounding areas including east africa which itself had just experienced historic flooding in late 2019 from heavy rain caused by an unusual warm indian ocean a single perfect storm 
isn't enough to bring in swarms of locusts of this size. It takes a series of them, something that used to be really rare in this area. But unfortunately, extreme weather that used to be really rare suddenly become more common as one of the hallmark of climate change. That could mean a future with more cyclones in the desert, more greenery where there once was sand, and more breeding ground for locusts. Thanks for watching.